Hi guys, I'm back. I'm back in my routine again. It's um, Thursday, so I'm going to do my Thursday freebies. Um, I don't have too many because I didn't really sign up for too many while I was gone from um, on vacation. So the first thing that I have here, and this is from um, the Rachel Ray. This is her um, sample of the dog food for dogs. And as you know, I have my little doggy digger. So I'm going to give this one to him. I think I had gotten this before. I don't know if it's the same one or not, but um, so that's good. And then Lanacane. This anti-chafing gel. I think there's other uses for this, and I want to say like um, I'm not exactly sure what it is. I have to look it up, but I think it's for your face. I just heard something else. Next thing I got, it just says here from it's from Oscar Mayer that they I think they sent this out to a lot of people, and it's just a thank you, and it says uh, for a free package of hot dogs, cold cuts, or bacon, up to $9. So I have to go to the grocery store and get like the biggest pack I can get for nine bucks because I'm quite sure you can't get like two. So that's good. This is um, Clear Scalp and Hair Beauty Therapy. Right here. Just like that. And there's a sample there. And actually, um, if you sign up for She Speaks, I'm, I think it might still be available. I'm really not quite sure. But they're going to be sending out um, bottles of this for you to try out and test out and give you a review on it. And I've heard really, really good things about this. And like using it just for one week makes a humongous difference. Um, that is supposed to start from the scalp. And um, you're going to see like a really big difference. So I really can't wait to use, start using this. And then getting my big bottles from She Speaks to test that out. So I'm waiting for that. And then the last thing I got for free in the mail was the Jiffy Recipe Book. And I really, I, you know, it comes out from time to time. I didn't sign up for it last time because I didn't think I wanted it. But then I saw somebody else that had it and I, they had so many recipes in here. And I wanted to try a couple of them. So that's why I signed up for it this time. So I really don't sign up for every freebie. I just sign up for what applies to me. I've seen some videos where people get like certain things and they're like, oh, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this. And um, I had done that a couple of times and I just thought, what's the point? I'm just gonna have it somewhere and I didn't have anybody to give it to either. So really what was the point? So inside my freebies, I just wanted to throw in a couple of little th tiny things that I had gotten on vacation. We went to um, the Yankee Candle Store, which I didn't even know I mean, I knew it was there, but the Yankee Candle Store, you wouldn't think that it is, you just go in there and you just see some candles, but I got this one. I took the top off of it. It's the vanilla cupcake one. Look at how yummy the cupcake looks on there. And it just looks like that. I've already burned it so many times. I actually just blew it out a few minutes ago. It smells just like cupcakes. <laughs> I just want to eat it. This is my favorite. I saw the really big one and I wanted it so, so, so bad, but I didn't get the big one. I got another one. I got, um, there's like, a, I think it's called Coconut K or Coconut Bay or something like that. I got that one. I gave that one away as a gift. Um, I also got, they had a big sale also. So I got this one here for Christmas time. And the scent is White Christmas and Happy Christmas. And it's just one of those scents that, you know, it's Christmas time. So um, I think I got these for like maybe 10 bucks or something like that. So that was good. And then these were all like on clearance and a dollar and stuff like that. These are just little tea candles. One is in lotus water. It smells yummy. And this one is in spring water. So, and these were like, I don't know. I really don't know how much they were. They were like maybe a dollar or something like that. I really don't know, but that's good. And then I got a whole bag of other little candles. You know what? I've never tried these things before, these little melt-aways. I don't know what they're supposed to be called, but um, we bought a little warmer where you stick these little things in and you warm it. These things never melt away, by the way. They just stay there in the dish. Um, and the scent lasts for days and days and days and days. I just went and checked it now. I think I've been home for a little over a week and it's still there and it's still on it. It's still warming. Um, it doesn't really have as much of a scent as it did when I first put it on there. And I'm like, what am I going to do with this wax stuff? So I'm just, I guess I'll just pour it out and just put a new one. But I got a whole bunch of different scents. Cottage Breeze. It's very like um, clean, like linen. 
and then beach walk and most of the scents they're all I kind of like um, go towards like clean scents a couple of these let me see beach walk also this one is biscotti it smells like cookies I like that like if it's really fresh or if it smells like cookies I don't really prefer to eat cookies and stuff like that but I like the smell of baking cookies this is another biscotti um, this one is oh I got a big one with beach walk and beach walk again I guess I like that one when I was there and this is coconut bay smells just like coconuts um, so this is the one that I got the mo the really humongous one that I gave away and this is be thankful it smells like you're baking pies or something I'm not sure it's like more like not the sweet part of the pie but like the dough part of the pie <laughs> yes I like that so I got two of those and then this is another coconut bay one um, and Yankee Candle is one of the better candles. It's like one of the best ones with the scents, for me anyway, that I've tried, um, that the scent just lasts. And when you light it up, it completely fills the entire room and even the whole house with one candle, which is pretty amazing. So I really like Yankee Candle. So I think um, the Yankee Candle store is like, um, well, to me, it's like the most humongous store that I have ever seen for a candle store. I walked in and it was like this massive, massive, it's like a shopping mall kind of store. It has so many different rooms and themes and it has toys and it has like a big old Christmas room and it has, it's just massive. So I went and I got a couple of things from there. I got, um, and I'm so glad that I went to the Yankee Candle store and I'll put like maybe like a couple of pictures or clips in when I put it in here. It was pretty, pretty massive. So I think Virginia is like the founding store or something. I'm not positive, but that's what I heard. So if you're in Virginia and you want to go to the Yankee Candle Store, that's you should definitely go if you like candles because, I mean, everything you can think of. They had, like, football-scented candles, which were completely gross. They smelled just like a football. Then they had sawdust. Like, they had a whole area for men, which it smelled like sawdust. And they had one for grass. It smelled like grass. That's so weird how they get that, those scents in those candles. Um, they have some pretty foul ones, too. And I, I can't remember the scents of them, but... I was laughing when I saw them. They even have a little area that you can put like your hands in the wax and make little, I don't know, like you're holding hands or something like that. So that was neat. Okay, the guys are here cutting the grass in the back of my house. He's like, no, don't go cut. Okay, he's cutting my grass. Awesome. He was like the community grass cutter. <laughs> I guess my kids are looking at them outside in the window. Awesome, we're getting your cut grass cut for free from these people thank you so that is all my freebies and all my um, not everything that I got when I went shopping because um, I got a lot of other things and if I can find them and if I can think about it I'll just incorporate it into some other video that I'm going to be doing so uh, and I plan on doing like a little tiny short video of like different hauntings or little haunted stories It'll be a really quick one because it's not like I had like massive hauntings happen to me while I was up there, but that'll be coming too. So, see you later. Bye.